love it. Yeah. What do you think of that? It's big. Yeah, it's it a big, big, big bottom. Well, welcome. Quentin King here, Paul here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana. Uh, so do you notice what you're playing there, right? It's an Epiphone? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's called the Texan. Okay, but it's not what you think. Look inside the tag. What do you think? Uh, What's that say? It says the Texan. And? Uh, that's uh, It's got some numbers. In, oh, what? Okay. See? Yeah, there it is. Made. Epiphone Incorporated, Bozeman, Montana. Made here in Bozeman, Montana. Oh, okay. So recreation. So normally you see an Epiphone, you would mm -hmm. relate that to, you know, all the newer Epiphones today, overseas made. The, Domestic. Yep. They, they made them in Japan. They made them in the USA way back. But, this, so this is a recreation of the ones made in the 60s. And very famous model. I'm Paul gonna, McCartney played I'm a, go out on played a the Texan. I can't say I've ever played a 1960s. And if I one from the 1960s, it right. would sound pretty good. I, I'm not sure they would have sounded this good. This is, I'm, yeah. I'm amazed at, at just the depth of this guitar. It's yeah. it's. It's got again, you know, not everybody's into the the low end uh, right. chug, but this this one chugs. Yeah, it's big, it's so yeah. big, but it's got enough clarity, you know. So this it's is a, in the same field as yeah. a, like a J forty five. Oh yeah, it's got some magic to it. It's yeah, a it different does. And you know, again, pick it up. It's like it's very light, and you can feel the whole guitar is resonating. It's just. Uh, you can have a uh, guitar that you can feel the resonation, but it uh, doesn't s necessarily have the depth. And this one's got the depth got for miles. Yeah. It's really cool. I, I wish I knew some metal that I could. <laughs> because it, you know, it yeah. definitely chugs. It's beautiful. Quentin wants to play metal on the Texan. Yeah. Well, Paul I don't know. McCartney. I was reading on this, reading up on this. He wrote. Was yesterday on one of these oh, on, on one a, of these on a Texan on a on an original Epiphone Texan that's what he, so there we go there you go that's oh, it okay I'm See? glad I, did, I got through that without messing yeah. it up what a great looking guitar all solid wood. Uh, we'll show all the specs on the side. I love yeah. the tuners. I mean, it's it's just a cool recreation, and it's made here in Bozeman. And, and it's uh, an Epiphone. It's, it's got it's got some features. It's got a, a pickup, yep, board pickup, the, the uh, LR bags. That. It's uh, you know. So I'm gonna confess, Epiphone is not a brand that was ever really on my radar, quite honestly, because I'm again Martin guy, and everybody knows Gibsons and all these other things. Mm -hmm. And Yamaha's one that's popped up. Eastman's popped up. Yeah. Well, Epif we've never really Epif done any Epiphone yeah. acoustics. Epiphone is now uh, on my radar. Hey. We're wearing the same shirts. Yeah, yeah, of course. The limited edition camo. We didn't even <laughs> try that. We didn't even do that This on was purpose. completely unplanned. He didn't call me and, you know. But, uh, yeah, these are the limited editions. They're no longer available, so sorry. For now, right? Yeah, for now. But anyways, Epiphone Texan. Uh, Quentin, thanks for checking it out. I'm glad you like it. Thanks, yeah. everybody. See you soon.